Former St. Andrews Church in St. Paul is going to meet the wrecking ball today. That's after a hard fight from neighbors who tried to save it. Ellery McArdle joins us outside of the church. And Ellery, do they have the equipment there? When are they going to start tearing it down? Yeah, absolutely, Gia and Chris. They have the backhoe here ready to go. You know, demolition is expected to start between 8 and 9 o'clock this morning. But as for this neighborhood, you know, this day will likely be sad and frustrating for a lot of people. You know, there are still a lot of people who are very upset that this church is coming down. They've worked for so many months to keep this building standing. Well, the Twin Cities German Immersion School owns this building and it plans to turn the space into a new gym, cafeteria, more classrooms and a meeting space for students with special needs and it's set to open next school year. Now in the past few months, we've shown you the protests from people who tried to save the church. They even tried making it an historic landmark, but the St. Paul City Council rejected that proposal. So there's been a rift between the school and neighbors, but school leaders hope the relationship can be mended. I mean, there are and will be some, some wounds from this whole process, but we're, we're hopeful that over time we can you know, continue to be a good neighbor and a successful school and that people will see that. So the school says it's trying to make some sort of an ongoing tribute to this church. Uh, it saves some artifacts from inside. It also has some drone footage to, to kind of save some of the architectural records of this church as well. Again, demolition is set to begin between 8 and 9 o'clock this morning, and we will have a photographer out here uh, capturing the changes that are happening in this neighborhood. Guys.